The vision of Jefferson Award Foundation Students in Action Program at St. Elizabeth High School, we try to encourage members to be engaged citizens within their communities, giving back through community service, and ultimately making them lifelong learners um, of service and community engagement. We try to encourage our students, as soon as they come in as freshmen, to be active members of our school community all the way up through their senior year. We try to encourage them through various programs that the Jefferson Students in Action Team support. For the Christmas card collection, we worked within the high school community, also asking for the help of other high school groups at the middle school and elementary school, and even asked for help from our parish. We collected over 10,000 Christmas cards, which exceeded our goal of 3,500. Through the program that we have at St. Elizabeth called the MANA program, Meeting a Need Now and Always, we track service hours for all of our students. By the time they graduate senior year, they need to clock 60 hours of service. However, most of our students go well above and beyond that call of 60 hours. I think that emphasis on community service and taking it beyond the school community has really become important to not just the group themselves, but to the entire school. The to write love on your arms um, also resonated with me um, being an administrator in a high school where you're always concerned about the welfare and the uh, safety and security of your students. For the program to write love on our arms, we reach every single student in our school by posting sticky notes with encouraging sayings on them on every single student's locker and it kind of gives them a boost at the beginning of the day. It lets them know they are loved and wanted and they could have a great day and it really just makes them smile. ILT, which is our youth leadership team, uh, give us the challenge to collect 10,000 shoes in honor of the 10,000 steps that many people in less fortunate countries have to take to get water. I think this project was worth participating in because it really brought the St. Elizabeth High School community together to serve the purpose of collecting shoes for the shoe drive. We hold an entire week long full of events uh, run by our SI team benefiting DFRC. This year we were able to run two events, one the handball tournament which we've run for four straight years and we also were able to introduce a spaghetti dinner catered by Cafe Napoli. Together through all of our efforts we were able to raise uh, $8,300 which goes directly to the program and to the families involved. Our school has logged over 14,000 service hours between our freshmen, sophomores, juniors and seniors and with all the projects and activities that we had this year we were able to collect both in-kind donations as well as fundraisers that totaled over $30,000. As an officer, I've been able to see many people come into their Students in Action team and grow as individuals and also grow as a team. We have been able to continue every single project that we have had over the last few years and we've also added a few more. Through the collaborative effort of our members and our leaders, we were able to have a successful year and to complete all of our goals.